looking at Star Wars Micro Galaxy Squadron Misty Vehicle Mystery Vehicles and more and figure and we see this is the wave that includes a couple of Clone Wars here. I'll have the series name right there before I post it. I'll have that one. And, and you'll see it was five ninety nine marked down to three ninety eight. Very cool when I found this at GameStop. So let's go ahead and get them open. Now the first one, simply just cut the tape here. And we'll just pop it open. It looks like they have been retaped up or the tape was really uh, good. And I just nicked my finger. I saw that on TV. So the first one we get is bum 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 tech. They're very nice. A bad batch. Simply just take this down and just set them on there. Now, the figure itself is one inch. Arms move up and down. Legs go out. Very cool looking figure. Now, we look at number two here. Simply just slide that over. Pop these open. And, oh, we have a Tuscan Raider. A new one. We see a Tuscan Raider here. Hands go up. Legs go up. And these are separate. These actually can go separate, which is very cool. Arms can't really do it but the legs can't that's nice so let's look at this skiff here our speeder bike from the book of boba fett let me see the spice members use very cool that there. Put this aside. And see I've got a couple of speeder bikes. Yeah. And now I'll take these and put these here. On to box number three. And let's see who we get on this one. And ooh look a first order troop on his speeder bike. Now we see this speeder bike here has the treads, laser cannons in the front, and these laser cannons do move. Well, that one does. That one's kind of sticky. Very cool looking speeder bike. Lots of details in this little bitty thing. You can see the cockpit there are the controls. Now the figure itself Hands move up, feet move up and down. Not really dependent on independent on each other. So we'll go ahead and slide that guy in there. Get it there. Now he does not have a stand because this rolls on the ground. He's like a Paw Patrol, I guess. So on to box number four. And yes, you hear Alyssa. She hears me talking. And I got another Tuscan Raider. Which is still nice because they can be independent of each other because there was more than one. This is very cool. So out of the packs, I got two duplicates. And one I already had. And there she is. The legs here are together, so I have to break them apart. That's kind of weird. I guess the factory, they like to, to do that. 
sometimes. All right, so I got two duplicates, and this is one of the reasons why these mystery packs are pain in the booty sometimes. You can see here. <laughs> Thanks, Alyssa. We have them, so yeah, it's, it's cool. It's uh, doable. They don't take up that much room, but yeah, that's the problem with these is uh, they're a mystery, and you could get duplicates. So if you get a duplicate, you might want to sell it. I know I am going to take a couple of them and probably put them in the, uh, the sale bin at the old mark. So until then, remember, as always, to like, subscribe, and keep collecting.